Nerlens Noel and Joel Embiid, they're gonna be very solid big men. But after that, you could pretty much take the top seven players from Kentucky and add to that mix, and that would be the Philadelphia 76ers basketball team. So with that thought process, if they played 10 games, I would think the 76ers would probably blow them out the first two or three games because college players aren't used to the physicality of the NBA level and the speed of the game. But once those young guys got wind of what it would take, I actually think they would beat this 76er team five times. No doubt about it. I think the Kentucky Wildcats are that good. And the Philadelphia 76ers, unfortunately for the fans in Philadelphia, you're that bad. Andre Drummond's skill set, I thought, and then being with USA Basketball was above that. The one thing that I wanted to see from him was great rebounding, but I wanted to see a young man that improved his offensive game, that found a way to score consistently, and then defensively was just a load for the other team. And I'm not seeing it. And I'm not buying the fact that you can shoot below 40% as a big man and improve your free throw percentage. So all those things right now are costing Andre Drummond. 